Hi everyone, Justin from Hyperbrew here to go over the features of Version Raptor, our new free tool to help you manage versions in Premiere Pro and After Effects. Save often in versions is generally a good rule to stick to in your workflow, and Version Raptor is here to help with that. To get started, go up to Window, Extensions, Version Raptor. This will open the panel in your workspace. You'll see we have buttons to add versions to your project, add versions to your sequence or comp in After Effects, set the number of hours you want to be reminded to save a version, and information on the last save and autosave of your project. And of course, the Raptor, our own personal version assistant. You can easily add a project version by pressing the Add a Project Version button. You'll see the version stem that's been added to the project name. In the same way, we can add a version to the active sequence or comp by pressing the Add a Version Sequence button. This will duplicate the sequencer comp and add the version stem. Now, whenever we want to create a new version, we can easily use the buttons to version up, make our changes, and go back to compare versions. Now, if we open an older project that hasn't been saved in a while, we'll get a warning from the Raptor saying the last save was 10 days ago. So we're going to want to version up this project. Simply press version up and Raptor's happy and our project is up to date. Now, if we accidentally open a project that's not the latest version, Version Raptor will warn us and not let us version up because a newer project version exists, which means this is probably not the project file we meant to open. Back to our latest, and Raptor is happy. In the end, Version Raptor is a simple tool that helps manage versions in your daily Premiere Pro and After Effects workflows. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to save often and in versions. If you do forget, Version Raptor is here to help. Cheers.